everyone, this is Chris with Syntec Consultants. I'm here to show you a quick tip to help prevent a catastrophe. So here at the bottom we have the status connection bar. It shows you details about your connection, your current connection. Here we have the server, the user, the database. So what I like to do, by default this is always yellow. And what I like to do is I like to change the color depending on the server that I'm connected to. So this helps out whenever I'm in development I do green whenever I'm in production I do red so this will help me quickly know what environment I'm in so I don't make a huge mistake so I don't run a truncate table on a production table when I actually meant to run it in development let me show you what I'm talking about we're going to close the query window disconnect make a new connection click the options button under the connection properties tab tick the use custom color checkbox let's say we're going into development for now we'll go green okay connect create a new query and as you can see the bottom status bar is now green and it'll stay green even if you run a query there you go let's do that one more time we'll disconnect close the query window you won't see the difference unless you close the query window new connection options use custom color select let's say we're going into production now I like red tells me to stop and think about what I'm about to do connect new query window there you go now it's red at the bottom make sure it stays that way even if we run query There you go.